And their luck ran out after they reportedly cashed in some stolen lottery tickets. Conyers police say one burglary suspect is behind bars and they have arrest warrants for his alleged accomplices. The trio reportedly stole the tickets during a burglary at a liquor store earlier this month. Conyers Police Sergeant Kim Lucas delivered some good news to the owner of the Sigmund Bottle Shop on Sigmund Road Tuesday morning. DeKalb Police busted one of the suspects in a December 8th burglary on Saturday. Both Conyers and DeKalb have warrants on uh, uh, Mr. Newell at this point. And that suspect, Tory Newell, now behind bars in the Rockdale County Jail. As the search continues for his alleged accomplices, 21-year-old Arkea Barrow and 24-year-old Quintavious Gray. At that point, uh, we did have one in custody. Uh, shortly thereafter, we got the other two, a male and a female, identified, and they are wanted at this point. Conyers police say the trio stole liquor, cigarettes, and lottery tickets from the Conyers store at around 3.30 in the morning on December 8th. Police say a surveillance camera later caught them cashing winning lottery tickets a few hours later at convenience stores in Decatur. And we do see all three individuals that are and were involved in our burglary uh, in possession of those uh, lottery tickets. Police got a big break in the case after they say Newell broke into this DeKalb County liquor store on Covington Highway early Saturday morning. A manager shared these photos of the damage from the burglary. DeKalb police spotted a car matching the one tied to the break-ins that same night, and officers took Newell into custody. Same method, uh, breaking in early morning hours, but certainly the same person that we do have in custody at this point, thanks to DeKalb County for locating him. Uh, so both now, Conyers police have issued arrest warrants for suspects Gray and Barrow. They're asking anyone with information to give them a call. Russ?